1. Primary Association of Finite Functionals The primary or spirit origin phases of finite reality find immediate expression on creature levels as perfect personalities and on universe levels as the perfect Havana creation. Even experiential deity is thus expressed in the spirit person of God the Supreme in Havona. But the secondary, evolutionary, time and matter condition phases of the finite become cosmically integrated only as a result of growth and attainment. Eventually all secondary or perfecting finites are to attain a level equal to that of primary perfection, but such destiny is subject to a time delay a constitutive super-universe qualification which is not genetically found in the central creation. We know of the existence of tertiary finites, but the technique of their integration is as yet unrevealed. This super-universe time lag, this obstacle to perfection attainment, provides for creature participation in evolutionary growth. It thus makes it possible for the creature to enter into partnership with the Creator in the evolution of that self-same creature. And during these times of expanding growth, the incomplete is correlated with the perfect through the ministry of God the Sevenfold. God the Sevenfold signifies the recognition by Paradise Deity of the barriers of time in the evolutionary universes of space. No matter how remote from Paradise, how deep in space, a material survival personality may take origin, God the Sevenfold will be found there present and engaged in the loving and merciful ministry of truth, beauty, and goodness to such an incomplete, struggling, and evolutionary creature. The divinity ministry of the Sevenfold reaches inward through the Eternal Son to the Paradise Father, and outward through the Ancients of Days to the Universe Fathers, the Creator Sons. Man, being personal and ascending by spiritual progression, finds the personal and spiritual divinity of the sevenfold deity. But there are other phases of the sevenfold which are not concerned with the progression of personality. The divinity aspects of this deity grouping are at present integrated in the liaison between the seven master spirits and the conjoint actor, but they are destined to be eternally unified in the emerging personality of the Supreme Being. The other phases of the sevenfold deity are variously integrated in the present universe age, but all are likewise destined to be unified in the Supreme. The sevenfold in all phases is the source of the relative unity of the functional reality of the present grand universe.